Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome, I'm Master Lia, and I just got a notification of Rico reacting to my comic, the comic that I did that many people got sad and depressed and at the same happy and... Yeah, that was uh, quite an adventure that I did with that comic, didn't it? And I had fun making it and I had fun making people cry because I'm sadistic as hell, but uh, <laughs> why not? So let's check the video, shall we? I'm excited to see his reaction and his voice acting because I, I, I <laughs> actually imagine him doing the voice of Mono and Six with my comic. It, 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 you will not be sad anymore, it will be hilarious. So, let's go. Master Leah has made a Little Nightmares 2 comic book and it is only right for me to react to it. I'm gonna be talking using the mono and six voice lines. So yes, <laughs> yes. I'm sorry to pause the video, but I'm really excited to see the voices. <laughs> I'm really excited. By the way, guys, don't forget, I'm gonna leave Rico uh, channel on the description. Go give a follow or subscribe to Rico, okay? He actually has a nice content and I really like it. So let's, let's get in. So Master Leah, really amazing artist. Leah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Here we go. <laughs> I try to save you. <laughs> Thanks, Six. You're welcome. <laughs> My hands hurt. Mine do too. You have a strong grip. Really? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> We're free at last. Now we need a plan for what to do next. <sighs> Don't worry, Six. We'll be fine. We just need to... I'm sorry to pause again. I... There are some parts of the comic that, uh... That is bad grammar. I apologize because the times that I finish the pages, it was always like 3 a.m. in the morning and I keep... Needed to be silent with the keyboard. So I needed like to... Eh, I didn't have time to review, I keep looking but with tired eyes if something was wrong with uh, with their speech. If anything you found that it's uh, like, okay, that's a weird sound, but yeah. I apologize for that, but let's continue. Sorry, Rico. Six, are you okay? What's the matter? <laughs> Six, talk to me, please. What's wrong? <laughs> Six, you're... This ain't good. Something's wrong with her. <laughs> Pathetic. So this is her curse, huh? I guess the tall man did something to her. Thanks to that, I got free. She's pathetic. Well, I kinda need her. Without her, I can't be whole again. Six, eat up. You! I know you! You guide me to that face man! Are you doing something to Six? This isn't her normal self! What do you want from her? Are you controlling her? Come on! Answer me, Glitch! <laughs> oh, please, Mono. Call me Shadow Six. And no, I'm not controlling her. She's got a curse. Shadow Six sounds very elegant talking like, please, no. Mm. Thanks to that tall man. You should remember that. But I'm not a simple Glitch. I have something that makes me feel alive. But for that, You'll need to fulfill what is making me empty. I'm the manifestation of her hunger, of her curse. It's really sad and pathetic how weak she can be, letting being captured and kidnapped every single time. Glad her prince shining armor always came to save her. Pathetic. <laughs> pathetic. Once I touch you, you will disappear like the other glitch kids. I've encountered so far, and Six will be fine without you. Now be gone! Oh no, you won't! Six! <laughs> <laughs> what the? Nom nom nom. <laughs> you! What did you do to Six? You really are controlling her! 
You will pay for this. I told you already. I'm the manifestation of her hunger. If she doesn't eat, she will die. And sorry for that, dear Mono. But at the moment, you are the only thing that looks appetizing. <laughs> Besides, it's not my fault of this damn curse. That man cursed her, and now because of that, she has hunger fits. Don't be mad at me. Be mad at that man. You should help her out. Aren't you her friend? Her savior? Don't you want to help her to get rid of the curse? Then give her what she wants. <laughs> 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 Six is enjoying Mono's heart, huh? If she doesn't eat, she'll die. Precisely. Help her, Mono. You're her only hope. <laughs> I guess I have no choice, huh? Doesn't matter what it is. I'm always here, Six. So whatever happens to me, I will always be your savior. So remember, <laughs> Six. Remember me. Remember Russ. Our adventure! It's funny as funny, don't you think? I thought we could be again free! Free together! But my dream was just a silly dream! A stupid and silly dream in this nightmarish world! Oh, good. I forgive you, Six! A few moments later... <laughs> Six is a... <laughs> oh! You're awake? Up six? Oh, Mono! Did you get the rest? <laughs> you got the word for a bit! You fainted and that scared me! Mono, you're bleeding your arm! Yeah, don't worry, I'll be fine. But are you okay? Do you remember anything? Fine! You lost your arm! And you're not looking fine at all! And I don't remember anything after we left the TV from the tower! <laughs> the somehow, tower. I felt something weird in me like I was dying of hunger! Don't worry too much about it. We'll be fine, trust me. Can't you just shut up about that? You're pissing me off. It's not fine. Nothing's <laughs> fine. This world isn't fine. You always pretend that everything's fine, but it isn't. <laughs> it's not fine. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, Six. I didn't mean to make you angry. I just don't want you to worry. Mano, just <laughs> shut up, will ya? I will take care of you, okay? But please, stop talking nonsense, okay? Okay. I will save you now. Okay, let me be the hero for once. Yes. How many times you saved me and I... I didn't say thank you. So now thank you for saving me from that tower. Huh? Blood? On my hands? Why do I have blood on my hands? Wait. Mano lost his arm. And he's still bleeding. Mm-hmm. Does, does that mean I ripped his arm off? Was that the cause of his misery? No, it can't be. I don't remember what happened, but I could never. No, 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 no. I remember I was hungry and I passed out. No, please, no. Did I eat Mono's arm? Did I really eat the human flesh? Mmm, delicious. <laughs> I'm truly... A nightmare among monsters. I'm a monster. Why? Why? I can't be like this. I should have let you go. Drop you there. Drop you on the tower. Six, please listen. Listen to me, please. I don't have much time. I'm really happy, you know, happy that you dropped me back there. I gotta confess, I, uh... I honestly didn't want to lose you. I'm sorry for breaking your music box. I'm sorry for the times I was useless and you got captured. I'm really sorry, Six. Please, Six, I want your forgiveness. The fact that I, in this comic, I put Mono apologizing so goddamn much, even though he didn't have any, you know, he was not the problem, neither Six was the problem, but... Neither Shadow Sex, to be honest, but none of them were the problem. But Mono still felt like he was like, okay, I think I screwed up. I tried to save you many times, but you keep, you know, getting captured, getting hurt, so it's my fault. That's what I was trying to do with this part over here. 
And the reason why Mono is uh, holding up, holding up this much after losing his arm and bleeding like hell, and why he was bleeding from his mouth, uh, was the fact that he was using his powers uh, to stay a little more to talk to Six. And those powers literally are killing him inside. That's why he was bleeding from the mouth. And yeah, if anyone was asking why Mono was bleeding. Oh no, I... This might be the last chance to tell you we are really happy we've been all this time together. Trust me, each other, help each other. I truly have feelings for you. Oh no, please I... I truly wish we could be together. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Mono, please! You need help! Please. Like I said, his power was killing from his insides, so the reason why he caught blood was because of that, and he could not stay more longer than that. Please, let me help you! <laughs> please, listen to me! <laughs> Let me help you with your arm! Six up. I really decided what I wanted. You stupid baggy, stupid boy! <laughs> I'm really sorry, Six up. You're okay. <laughs> Promise me you won't let anyone hurt you. Six, can you excuse me? You can refuse him, of course, Six up. <laughs> I'm sorry for asking such a thing. I understand if you refuse. I just really love you. We had a crazy adventure together. And the more we kept on going, I was falling. Falling for you. Wherever you go, I'll go. Whenever you're in danger, I'll save you, Six. Okay, in this part, I literally put Mono saying th stuff to Six, uh, saying like, you need to go one, please don't do anything evil, try to help others. Like, what I meant with this was I knew after this she could go to the mall. So she could help the gnomes, she could try to help some kids, but yeah. And what he said about evil... He already knew that she was uh, about to eat people, so he was trying to warn her, like, don't do evil. So please, Six, try your best to not let yourself lose control. But that didn't happen, so we kind of saw Six eating a gnome, which was Kai. <laughs> Rest in peace, Kai. Happy, free and together with me. Free? Happy? <laughs> Manu, you sure are stupid. <coughs> what? Was I really happy? I didn't smile once in my life. Not even once, but somehow you, you had the courage to test me. And finally, when we played together, I did share a smile. So let me thank you for that smile <laughs> and for those lovely moments. <laughs> Don't do the noise. Don't. Is is a kiss. <laughs> I was not expecting him to make the noise of the kiss. <laughs> oh my god, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Don't do this. <laughs> I can't stop. Oh. oh my god, I think I'm crying. <laughs> oh, my eyes. <laughs> oh, 
It's one thing that I, I, I get cringe about. It's when I hear kisses, sound kisses. It's weird for me. Uh, but it was a good kiss, I guess. It was a good kiss sound, Rico. I don't, I'm not saying it was a... Okay. <laughs> Let's continue, shall we? So warm and gentle. I never thought I would kiss someone. But I'm happy it was with Manu. I'm very sorry. I can't hold on much longer. I can't breathe. I'm so weak. I try to use my power to stay a bit by your side. But my powers are holding. He says this. I'm so sorry. I have to go. I wish for a minute we could. Jesus. Uh, Mano? Hi. Oh, no! With a little rest of my power and yours combined, I reset everything. Different lives, different timelines, different cage. I knew I couldn't be alone anymore here. Mono! <laughs> and here, we are inseparable souls. In this world. Wait, should I put soulmates? Ah, dang it. I should have put soulmates and not souls. That could sound a little better. We're so happy for having each other. Hi. Ever you felt like we start all over? Like a new file for a video game or write a new book? This is that sensation. Starting something new with you, Sid. Let's be happy. Make a family on our own. Go places, face this crazy world. Let's put an end to this nightmare and make it our live dream. Our embrace is so warm. Your body on mine is so relieving. Every time we touch, I feel safe. And so do you. Our kisses are something we wish so much. Feeling your lips on mine. I know once, when life is over, there'll be a new start again. I'm feeling so lucky, nothing can get between us. I'm sorry if I keep saying this, but I love you so much. You will never be alone, having me to hold her. And when nights are cold, I'd say... The world's not perfect, when the world's not kind. If we have each other, then we'll both be fine. I will be your lover and I'll hold your hand. You should know I'll be there for you. Hey! <laughs> nice. I don't know if Riku got that reference uh, in the last page. This is actually a, a music uh, from uh, Alec Benjamin. That the world's not perfect, but the world's not kind. If you had each other, then we'll be fine. You know, I put a lot of refer uh, music reference, like uh, when Mono is dying here. In here, he says, I can't breathe, I'm so weak. Uh, it's another music that it's called uh, Your lo uh, Love is Gone. I can't breathe, I'm so weak. I know this isn't easy. Don't tell me that your love is gone. I put that and in that part where they're hugging. Cause every time we touch, I feel the stand. You know, it's, I put a lot of uh, music reference uh, in this comic. Uh, which I keep hearing the mu uh, a, a playlist from the YouTube. And I keep having, I have this idea for this line of the music. Why not? I applaud Rico. You did a good job. I was, I was, I was actually hoping for you to make like, in this part that Mono is older and Six is older. I was hoping for you to make like um, their voices a bit adult-like. But I can't imagine Mono as an adult having that voice as well. Why not? <laughs> But I really enjoy it. Uh, thank you for voice acting uh, my comic. It was either it was both sad and hilarious because it was actually it was hilarious at the point that Six is eating Mono's arm. I think you got the feeling of the comic and you're starting to go a little bit sad in the tone of your voice. 
it sounded like it and I'm surprised I'm actually surprised that people cared a lot a lot for this comic I was not expecting people to care about this comic I just made this comic because I like little nightmares too I like little nightmares I like the all the things about little nightmares it's funny because I actually only got a fan of little nightmares once the second game came out and I was actually very very all cutesy when I saw mono like the character itself is adorable. I fell in love with everything from the Little Nightmares because I keep uh, before I was in the in the fandom. I was like, why people are sharing so much about this game? I know I've seen some I've seen uh, some things about the first game, but I never care about the first game. So once the second game came out, I've saw friends uh, on Instagram sharing oh Mono is such a good friend this and that and I was like okay I need to check this out so yeah I got into a game uh, I made this comic so why not and people were actually enjoying my art from Little Nightmares and my comics I was not expecting that actually and I'm very happy that people are enjoying uh, the things that I do it's it's an amazing adventure making the these comics and fan arts of the little nightmares even though from other stuff that I do it's amazing I really like I really enjoy your s support and everything you guys have been doing for me and it's quite amazing once again Rico you did a really good job on the voice acting I'll end up the video here guys once again Rico's channel will be on the description. Don't forget to check in and subscribe to Rico. He has a really good content. And I'll see you guys on the next video or stream. Love you all.